This photograph of Tupac and Suge was taken after the fight at around 10.55 p.m. They were headed for Suge's dance club, followed by an entourage of musicians and bodyguards. Tupac, who normally was known to pack a weapon, as was Suge and, and many people in the entourage, they weren't armed that night, and, and everybody said they felt safe. Reporter Kathy Scott is writing a book about the murder. So it was a very festive mood. They were obviously they were playing, playing the music loud, so they were in a party mood. They were flirting with women. At 11:10, Tupac and Shug pulled up to an intersection and spoke with two unidentified women. The two were looking at the girls and talking to them. That's what the witnesses have told police. And that's when a white Cadillac drove up on the passenger side next to Tupac and opened fire. Tupac tried to climb into the back seat and didn't make it. As the attacker sped away, Shug Knight took off in the opposite direction. He finally stopped in front of a casino one mile away. 